Today we're going to tie up some uh, egg sacs. We've got some uh, salmon egg, some brown trout eggs, and we're going to go do a little uh, pier fishing for uh, steelhead and brown trout. Now, some guys say it's too easy. It's cheap to use bait for steelhead. I say what's wrong with easy, man. I'm out there, enjoy the outdoors, and catch a bunch of fish too. I'm for easy. <laughs> I got here some uh, brown trout eggs, some Lake Ontario uh, king salmon eggs. These work pretty good. Here's a mesh we're going to use spawn net. Use some of this here spawn net. We got some chartreuse, some white, and some peach. I ran out of pink, man. Pink's usually a hot color too. Well, it helps tying up the bait quick with this here elastic string. All right, got our scissors here. Our eggs ready. Spoon for dishing it out. And we'll tie up some trout bait. All right, I'm gonna do up a chartreuse here. This chartreuse egg sack here. This one I'm gonna use some salmon eggs. I'm gonna put about seven of them in this one. They're not too big, but not real small either. Let's just grab the edges, pull it together. I'm gonna use a chartreuse match the elastic string with this, with the color of the mesh we're using. Wrap it around, just get a little pull, cinch it tight. No knots or nothing involved there. There you go. Alright, here we're going to tie up a white one. See, I like white. When you get extremely clear water, you can't beat white. You know, it just lets the natural color of the egg show right through. Tie up a real small one here, in case the water is real clear. We'll tie a variety. You never know how, to, how your stream conditions are going to be. So. Here's a small one for uh, clear water, clear water fishing. Right. There's some chartreuse. And got white, so we use chartreuse. No. Shut up, Shelly. It's alright, this will be good to use. Now look at that. That's one for clear water. All right there is for clear water steelhead. You see how small that is. Nice looking egg sack there. We're tying a bigger one here just in case we stop at a stream. It's a little bit higher, stained. Nice chartreuse one with salmon eggs. Use a chartreuse uh, elastic string. Wrap around three times, pull it. Three times, pull it. Three times, pull it. Just trim it off. The elastic holds tight. Don't even have to tie it on. I love this stuff. Makes it tight and easy. Yeah, it's beautiful. There's a variety of different sizes of egg sacs like tires with real jumbo dirty water. There's some uh, medium lightly stained water. All the way down to gin clear water right there. There's a lot of commercial cures out there for curing your eggs before you tie up your bait. Uh, everybody's got their own homemade recipe. I like to keep it simple. There's two ways I cure my eggs. One way is I just stream harden it by putting the eggs in a bag and running some stream water over it, letting them set for about 15 minutes. Hardens up the egg a little bit. And the other way is salt cure. And I'll put enough salt and cold water in a bowl so that the eggs float and I'll let them sit in there for about 20 minutes or a half hour or so. Hardens up the membranes a little so when you freeze them, the ice crystals don't puncture the membrane. About a half hour's time, here we go, we got a enough bait to go out and slam a bunch of nice trout. Oh, those look good, man. And they smell good. You know what? I might even eat one.